half of a large onion. Oh, first you um, scrape scrape the skin. skin. Are you crying? Yes, it's the onion. Oh. Onun için sana söyledim, sulan makinesi al bana diye almadım. Okay, now we're grating the zucchini that's been skinned. And you do the whole thing. Yeah. So now the zucchini is all grated. It's all finished. It's all in the pot. What's next? One third of a tablespoon. That's too much. Okay. It's not too much. Okay, how many eggs? One. Just one, one egg. One or two. One or two. You're gonna put how many? Just one. one. Okay, then you mix it in. I need some cheese. Hard cheese, like light cheddar or something. Okay, coming right up. Cheese is ready. And we grate as much as you like. Well, there must be a limit. Yeah, it shouldn't be too much because then it's going to stick to the pan. And this can be any type of cheese. Hard cheese. Hard cheese and preferably with a sharp flavor. Not necessarily. Not necessarily, okay. That's optional. If you like sharp flavor, then by all means it can be sharp. And we're using kashar cheese. Taze. Fresh. Which corresponds to something like a mozzarella. Maybe a quarter of a cupful. Okay. Quarter of a cup. At least half a cup. Half a cup of flour. At least. At least. And the consistency has to be like pancake. Like pancake. Like batter. So not too dry and not too watery. Last step we add how much dill? Fresh or frozen dill? Like a tablespoon, two tablespoons? No. One palmful. One palmful? Oh, chopped dill. Add a little extra flour? Yeah, if it gets a little bit too liquid. Well, that's a lot of extra flour. <laughs> well, it's going to give off a lot of liquid. The zucchini is mm -hmm. over time. If you don't want the zucchini to give off so much water, you grate it first and then squeeze it in your palm, get rid of the excess liquid and then proceed. Then you won't need as much flour. That's okay, so this is try. the last step? Possibly. Then you make, you fry just one and test the salt, salt content con levels. The consistency is like pancake. Pancake batter. Maybe a little thicker. Heavier. Heavier. Okay. And here I just sprayed the pan with Pam. And I guess we're going to test. You should put some oil too, a few drops. A few drops of oil. Okay, I added a few drops of olive oil on top of the Pam. And uh, we make sure it's sizzling. Sizzling first. We turn it on. A little bit low heat, not too low, not too high. So medium heat. Wait till it gets hot and then add a thin spoonful. Okay. In order to understand whether it's ready or not, şöyle yapabilirsin bir tane. Just yapmıyorsa, it's not ready. Okay, so if it's not sizzling right away, it's not ready. Is it ready now? Is it sizzling? A little bit. 
Okay, then it's ready. Now here goes one spoonful. Yep, you have to hear that sound and then spread it out thin. Evenly. Evenly. In an oval shape. Here's the first one. Wait till it cools a few seconds. And then... Look. 